where is home for a TCK? If a wife struggles with that question of what do you do, and you know, you just sink into the woodwork, if you ask a third culture kid, where is home? They'll just go, what? what do you mean, where is home right now? Where was I born? You ask three children living in a family, where is home? They'll all have a different answer. Where are you from? That's another one that flummoxes them. Where are you from? I, mean, I don't know. I'm from wherever my parents are today. They really don't know where is home and where they're from, which is why I tell them or I tell the parents so that they can tell their kids home is not a geographic location. Home is an emotional location. Home is where you do not have to explain yourself. So even though one child once said, home is the Holiday Inn, because that's where they went on home leave, home is really where you feel comfortable. And it's another reason why third culture kids tend to gravitate towards other third culture kids when they meet them or when they go to university, they gravitate towards the foreign students on campus, even though they themselves don't look foreign, inside they are foreign. They wear their experience on the inside. All of these things I say, and I say it quickly, and, and really I'm just giving you the highlights, but I say this because if parents have this language, third culture kids, uh, global nomads, all these, the words that surround the subject of them, it's important that you use them a lot with your children. Children can have a vague feeling of something, and the minute you put a name to it, it's like, oh, that's it. And that can be something as simple as, homesickness mommy i have a stomach ache well you're homesick oh that's it i'm homesick now i'm fine they may have issues about their identity and you say you know what you're a third culture kid oh that's what i am that's where i belong it all comes down to where they feel they belong and you as parents you're the ones who are responsible for helping them find their place in the world